All right, it's the first game in a while. Uh, I was you know, pretty busy with schoolwork and went on a little vacation, saw the Flyers beat the Rangers twice, so that was cool to see. Uh, they were right back in division race, but I uh, got my own, uh, you know, division race here in the Big Ten East, playing against the Washington Huskies. Always talented. Hi, everybody. Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. The Mountaineers have shown few signs of weakness lately. They are exuding confidence in everything they do. String together a few W's, that's exactly what happens. We'll see if they can keep it up. That's going to do it for us. Thanks for checking out the pregame show. NCAA college football action coming right at you. Brad and Kirk on the call. David and I are back at halftime. We're in Husky Stadium in Seattle, Washington, and we are looking forward to bringing you a great matchup today. Before we head down to the field for the coin toss, we'd like to remind you this game is brought to you by... He's going to try and scramble. They'll make the sack. A great defensive end in college football just pins his ears back and has, again, that extra instinct to know when to jump the snap count. He's scrambling. And he's tackled right around the 40. The Mountaineers always have guys that are near the top statistics. I was thinking that I might, you know, be a little rusty because I haven't played in a while, but so far, no problem. That was a very good all-around effort. The running, the blocking, the entire package. A well-deserved score. And he adds the extra point. Reese Davis is standing by with this update. Reese. Time to check out what's going on in L.A. Arizona comes away with the win by one. In another game, the Spartans hmm, were ranked 11th in like the nation. Before. They hope that spot proves they are capable of rising much higher. And for Michigan State, they remain red hot. And for Anderson, more than a workmanlike effort today with four touchdowns. Best way to describe this kid, the truth. The Spartans get a W that's perfect to rude. them. That's a play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. Here's a counter play. He's to the 40. He gets hit out of bounds. At about the 49. He lets it go. And he snags that one. He's knocked out of bounds around the 15-yard line. Unbelievable. Like, how does it, there are like three guys there. They'll line up for the extra point in an attempt to tie the game. And he converts the extra point. A six play, 73 yard drive. And they get it in back last time. He's scrambling, and he's going to be sacked for a loss. West Virginia's got a guy behind center that can really do it. <laughs> How about that? And he's taken down around the 40-yard line. Well, I'll tell you something. Confidence can easily turn into cockiness, which is not... He's at midfield. Defense options. And he is drilled. The 27 yard line. So at the end of one, we're even at seven in this one. And here's a quick throw. Brought down. Denied. Got the tackle again. Washington. 
Washington with a six-point lead. And he hits the PAT. A five-play, 72-yard drive. And that's good for a touchdown. Brad, that's one of those drives that can just tear your heart out. It can really demoralize the defense when they drive. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. He's to the 10. At the 30. The Come 50. on. Ah, how do you now run him? At the 39-yard line. I've said it time and time again. Games are won and lost with special teams. Ready! The 10. Tackle made around the three-yard line. Touchdown, Mountaineers. Here's the PAT to tie this thing up. And he tacks on the extra point. It was a five-play, 38-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. Brad, I thought that was... Quick throw. What the fuck? I thought I picked that for a second. Out of bounds at the 49-yard line. Inside the 10. Touchdown, Washington. Washington is up by six. He makes the PAT. So a six-play, 77-yard drive, and they come away with a touchdown. So the score now, 21-14. Up the middle for a nice game. Game of six on the play. Let's go! Fires quickly, and he's got his man. Touchdown, West Virginia! be tied with the extra point and he adds the extra point a 10 play 74 yard drive and the result seven points Brad I thought the offense did a really not and he hits him hard at the 30 yard line this kid just doesn't stop that's we will finally get off the field this offensive line it must feel like they're going up No, and he throws it away. The flag came out after the ball was thrown. Yeah. Let's see what this is. I thought I timed that a little bit better. He was a step too late and he knows it. He learned not to make those kinds of mistakes. They'll make the That's a little bit better. Booker, he's got three sacks now. What a game. Boy, what a hit on the quarterback. He was lucky to hang on to the ball during that sack. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. Pick. Intercepted. He's flirting with danger all game. At about the 43-yard line. I'm really impressed with this guy's closing speed on the ball. He's got the kind. Scrambling around. Quick throw out to the receiver. And he's taken down at about the 27 yard line. Screen, watch the screen. Watch the screen. He's on the run. Keeps it, and he's got a touchdown. He splits the uprights with the extra point. It's close. You can't afford to waste possessions. 
got them. Here they come. West Virginia is going to use their first time out of the half here. They've been all over this quarterback today. He's wrapped up for the sack. Well, he isn't one of the best players in the country for nothing, Kurt. He is just relentless. Got him again. Man, it's an offensive lineman. This is the worst thing that you want to see. Is your quarterback not only getting sacked, but getting hit like that. Those linemen better pick that quarterback up and start doing a better job of taking care of him. And now they're faced with another third and long as they try to convert and move those chains again. That's the end of the half, and believe it or not, folks, it's still anyone's ball game. The Mountaineers with a touchdown lead. He's scrambling. He's to the 40. Decides to slide. Oh, before you get hit. Tackled after a decent run up the gut. No. Arthur Morgan got hurt. You gonna be okay, boy. No, he's not gonna be okay. Fucking A. Well, we're gonna have to find a way to do it with Sherm. Now we'll see how the backup can do after that injury. Ooh, look at this one. Gets out to around the 12. West Virginia is up seven. Touchdown, Mountaineers! And he converts the extra point. Ah, uh, needs to be picked. Close to being intercepted. The kick missed is up, it. and he missed it right. Wow. No good. Look at this. Sherman. He's no! He makes his way out to about the 35. That's three down and one to go. West Virginia's in front by 14. Shotgun and five wide out. We're bringing the house. And as he throws, and this one's going to be intercepted. They yeah, want the 45. That's just where we had the ball in the 46. It's a negative one yard punt. He's going to try and scramble. And they push him out at about the 13. Scrimmage trying to keep him out of that end zone. Quarterback draw, no. Washington. And he hits the PAT. So a seven play, 45 yard drive. And they come away with a touchdown. It's fourth down and the offense is getting set to go for it. No, my fuck. That was such a stupid call by me. Sherman fucking sucks, man. And like the offense just goes stale with him. 
Cool. And he's level at the seventh. Nothing doing that time. Defender stayed home. Blocking wasn't there, and down he went. Five men up front looking for a big goal line stop here. And he Stuffed him. Holy shit, that was close. So this one goes final. A hard-fought, close game. West Virginia, 35. Washington, 28. Washington, 28. That does it for this edition of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, I'm Brad Nessler saying so long. wasn't my best game, but considering the fact that I had to do it with Sherman, not with Arthur Morgan, I mean, we'd take a win. Alright, we're in the next week. We're going to take a look at the top stories, and the number one team lost by a point. So it bumps us up a little bit. Well, my old team's the new number one. Taking a peek at the top 25, and I'm, I'm kind of cringing at it because my quarterback's going to be out, and i got to play the number two team in the nation, number 20 who I play this week, and I think the other team is Ohio State, which, you know, they're going to be super talented either way. So not going to be a fun stretch with the, with the backup quarterback. We'll see if we can survive. The recruiting roundup. And we replaced an outside linebacker for a new one. We'll see if we get a little bit closer on Bo Burks. Other than that, I mean, we're within striking distance for everyone that we're behind on. So that's that's um, good news. But the bad news is there's quite a few guys that we're behind on. Not a crazy amount that we're ahead on. At least, you know, not with a big enough lead. I'd like to see maybe some of these guys, you know, jump into the thousands. And for these guys in the thousands... Come on, what are we doing here? Start committing. You're going to West Virginia. It's just the one commit still so far. That's it for today's game. I will be able to play this game against Michigan tomorrow. Uh, with the backup quarterback, so I don't know. We'll see how that goes. Gonna have to, I mean, hey, I beat him in the big house, you know, my first year at West Virginia with a backup quarterback. So hopefully uh, you get a repeat of that. But, uh... As for my channel, I'm still just uploading, you know, old clips that I saved with my PS4. Kind of doing it gradually. Um, I'll, we're in 2019's clips, so I'll catch up. Hopefully get to the point where I can upload clips as they happen. Instead of, you know, uh, just throwing a shit ton of them up on my channel all at once. And if you want, you can like this video, subscribe to my channel. We will chat later.